sorting sodas and shit like that. Who wants to do that, bro? Come on now. <laughs> Good morning, friends. Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator, seems to have awoken without too much worry. Um, I think I'm gonna stick uh, some fish in here. Just a couple of fish. Do I have anything else? I don't think so. Yeah, my fishing line did not, or my fishing rod didn't break completely. I just need to get some string for it. A little bit of string. I'll carry this. Ease my burden just a little bit. While I do give up some power with the baseball bat, I think it might be worth it. Maybe. Five in the morning, but we're cooking up some uh, delicious treats. Am I supposed to cook this? Fresh, uncooked. I guess it's cooking. <laughs> I was confused because it said nutrition. Well, what's the nutrition? I don't understand. Uh, I'm scared to cook it a little faster because last time I did, I ended up burning the pike. Which is not pleasant. As one m might think. Alright, but this time I'm going to get it. Ready? Go. Go. Turn it off. All right, did we do it? Hell yeah. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. I'm gonna eat half of this uh, stir fry. Hang on to that pike for a minute. Oh, there's not much left to that herring either. Go ahead. Go ahead, help thine self. What a good little trip. If I uh, find some more fishing line, I would be glad to do some more fishing, but I think I'll have to find uh, a house with a garage or something like that relatively far out from my house um at least for one with a fucking broken foot <laughs> so uh we need to be careful most careful and i also need to read my uh, intermediate cooking book finish my advanced carpentry book unfortunately you can't read while you walk which is just ludicrous <laughs> you totally can it's probably not advised while you while you have zombies in the neighborhood or if you're not, like, you know, alone on the street. Which some people might not be, but that's kind of crazy for me to imagine because nobody walks in L.A. Nobody walks in L.A. That's fucking the truth. <laughs> the untold truth. And, uh, I'm, I'm somewhat victim to that. I mean, who really reads books anymore anyways? I guess you got your little Kindle or, uh... Your, your audio ebook on your iPod, which what I think was a joke I made in the outro last episode. Oh, man. Um, but yeah, I don't think books will ever die as like a physical media. That don't make much sense. <clears throat> hmm. I don't want to stop back through here. We're going to make, make sure Spiffos is empty. That's for damn sure. Let's, uh, let's grab this fresh frozen burger. It's fresh frozen. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll take this. I'll take that. What's really gonna go bad here? Lettuce will, tomatoes will. Everything else here seems pretty preserved. Does butter go bad? Not really. It does, like, have an off flavor to it, but you can still use it as butter. <laughs> I know. I left a stick in my stick of fridge in my stick of butter in my fridge for like, God, it must have been five or six months. And uh, yeah, we were hard up. They were like, "Do we have butter?" My roommate, my roommate asked, "Do we have butter?" I'm like, "Yeah, maybe. You should try it." And uh, I didn't say how long it was in there. He was like, "Oh, there's like." A yellow part on the outside of it and I was like yeah just cut that off bro <laughs> I don't know what that is which is probably like the fat coming to the top or something like that oh it was bad it was real bad that's all I could say what the fuck the town hall has been completely infested it seems like which is not good because it's right across from my base it's just because it has a, a big open door so people think they can waltz right in. My place is boarded up. Boarded up fucking tight, you hear? 
Maybe I could go to the gas station. Maybe I could just uh, put my shit down. Let's put my shit down for a second. Have another little snack if we want. But I know I've been uh, pinching just a little bit from the fridges. <laughs> I'm a hungry boy. Hungry growing boy. So uh, I want to make sure that my fridges are absolutely at capacity when uh, when the power finally does drop. Yeah, see? We ain't done right the right stuff here. There's some space. Been enjoying too much. Enjoying too much, working too little. Oh, my thing went away. I need my healing boost. Give me! Shove some bacon in there. Just rub some bacon on it. Um, this can go in a drawer. Goodbye. Goodbye! Ginger. Hmm. Adult magazine I might keep. Little bait fish. Do these go bad? I'd assume not. Let's, uh, let's stack those magazines. Mm-hmm. I, I, I said mm-hmm. Oh, no. I can't. Damn it. Put it in this one. Right? Is that correct? Did it go in the fridge? <sighs> Adult magazine. There it is. Duh. Oh, and I, I fed well, but I need to drink just a little. And uh, I will finish my, my carpentry book so we aren't lugging that around with us. It's another pound that I don't need. Finally finish this fucking thing. But it takes so long! Well, I guess not so long when you've read most of it already. But still! Unacceptable! Oh, was that my hunger thing going away? Bobbling over there? I guess so. Ta-da! Advanced carpentry complete! Everybody celebrate. Everybody celebrate. Okay. Got my pike. Dude, that is such a good way to fucking... Oh. I don't even technically need fridges. I could have gone completely another way with this playthrough. And I still might, I guess, if this fucking base gets too compromised. And just, like, run off into the fucking woods. Become a wild man. <laughs> Oh, man. I'm so scared of, like, everything now. All these windows are broken out. You just know there's a fucking zombie lurking. I've done my best to keep the streets clean. But look, how many zombies does that amount to? Like, nine or ten? <sighs> We're fighting losing battle, gentlemen. It's not gonna be okay. And I don't say that lightly. We spent a long time to get this far. I want it to be okay. Oh man, this guy's tough. You've been in a few fights, haven't you, fella? It's your last fight. Good fight, good night. He's got a dirty bandage. Gross. I need some fuel. Please give to me. Another gas can. Put it on the fire. Alright, we got room for just a little more stuff. Hmm. Garbage bag. Come with me. I'll give you a nice new home. Most of this is going. Yeah, I'll want this. I'll want this, I'm sure. I don't need to put all of this in the fridge. Actually, I probably should empty some of it out of the fridge. Just in case. Just in case. It goes bad. Fresh, uncooked, frozen steak. Mmm. I'm so grateful. Give me all these things. Some more magazines. Yes. I will take... Newspaper? I guess it works, but... I ain't gonna fuck with it. <laughs> oh, there are more gas cans in here. That's what I was hoping for. Okay, we can fit two more. I'd shove that one in there. And then we'll have to carry the last one, which will put us overweight, but not so much so that it's backbreaking. So, uh, yeah. Another good fucking run on gas cans. Ugh! Victory! Supreme victory! Takes more. 
Take some more. Threatened back injury. Yeah, that's what I want to avoid. So I put one away. We still got fucking 19 pounds. Oh my god. I can walk it over there. It's no thing. How many do I have? Four more gas cans. 16 gas cans. Holy shit. <sighs> we ready, Bo. And I'm gonna fill up my fridge with all this food. Probably do a little bit of inventory management, which, um... I don't know if I want to do on screen. The last episode did run a little short, and the one before ran a little long. If I cut too much, this one might run a little long. It's uh, a hard thing to balance, I will say that much. But I hope that you're enjoying the journey, friends! I definitely didn't expect it to go this well. I think it's mostly because everything is all in one place. Instead of, like, booking it to the mall, I kind of just gathered up what I need. Oh, here's a pharmacy, here's a police station. And now I've got, like, a restaurant full of food and guns. Which I need to keep safe. This is my place. I need to keep it very safe, don't you see? Ah, back safely inside with so many gas cans. What? That's so awesome. I'm proud. I am proud of my fucking giant pile of gas. Look at this shit. Look at this shit here. Put some more over here. <laughs> Let me put some more over here. Yeah. We got more. There's another one. Yeah. An insane amount of gas. To be sure. 15 or 16. It's never enough. But I haven't gone too far. I'm gonna really worry once the water starts going off. The next thing I need to do is, is get those rain collector barrels going. Can I... Yeah, I need my hammer, I think out in order to even have the build menu available, which is something that took me a long time to, to realize. Wooden crate, bar, furniture, mm, rain collector barrels, yes, I can build these. Four planks, four nails, four garbage bags. Four planks, four nails, four garbage bags. Doesn't seem too bad. Got a couple logs out there. Got some nails in my in my pack here. I probably should throw uh, throw all this stuff where it belongs before I get too too involved sorting sodas and shit like that. Who wants to do that, bro? Come on now. <laughs> uh, we'll put some ice cream. Ice cream goes in here. Pizza, pie, salmon. Why not? steak. Got one garbage bag. I'll take that out. Burger. You could eat that burger. He let it thaw. He was patient. <laughs> patient, kind, reverent. Uh, a little bit more. Keep the jar in here. Magazines. I think everything else basically could go. I might want one pack of painkillers, uh, but it seems like my pain is not coming back, really. Unless I take off the fucking, uh, <laughs> the fucking splint. And then I'll feel it for just a second. Disinfectant painkillers. Good. Put this in the medical bag, because that's where things like that go. Saw, also. Kitchen knife, okay. <laughs> that, that can all pass for medical bag. Fishing line and fish? No, I don't think so. Small pike, okay. We've stripped it down quite a bit. Quite a bit. As much as I can, I suppose. Can we eat all of these at once? Or do I just like one at a time? Mm. <laughs> Snackies. Uh, here's a couple more garbage bags. I gotta rummage through all my shit for the garbage bags. There were a bunch in this drawer. Is this where I offloaded most? Yes! And if we get one more, then we can make an additional one. I'm sure I have it somewhere. Somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. 
Yep. There's even more. Find two more. Two more garbage bags. We can do it. We can do it. Maybe they are just sitting in here. And I haven't come across them yet. That's entirely possible. Or I might need to uh, not fucking worry about it because I probably don't have enough planks to keep up with that amount of shit. But oh my god, this is totally the farthest that I've ever gotten in Pro Project Zomboid. Quote unquote farthest. Um, what do we do? Am I gonna know if there's a fucking a mouse in the trap? Will it just like appear? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand. All right, grab these planks. We'll put all of this shit together. That'd be so nice. And, uh, saw logs. Saw them fucking logs up. Saw them up. I hope that I can keep this, uh, this entire thing locked down. <laughs> it might not go well once I turn that generator on. But I'm not gonna really know until that point. So, might as well keep going. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Uh, furniture, rain collector barrel, seven carpentry, stockpile water supplies, stockpile supplies before the water shut off. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need fucking all kinds of shit, are you kidding me? <laughs> this is a, a crazy, crazy thing. I'm gonna make as many of these as possible. Does the water, like, go bad? Does it fucking stagnate and get gross? Oh my god. We never even considered this. Need four planks. Three... and four. Easy. Easy. Down, Matumbo! Down! Alright. There's three planks there. Guess I'm gonna drop all this shit. Hmm, that's a lot of nails. Tell you what. Um I'm gonna need my axe. I'm gonna need my axe. And then I can uh chop just a little more. Just a little more. Get a few more fucking rain collector barrels. Get one of these. Get one of these. Um, but don't put it in there. Is it okay to leave all these doors open? I guess as long as I don't leave one of the outer doors open, it's fine. Maybe. <laughs> Unless a fucking giant horde comes. Destroys my shit. Takes up residence in my house. Damn, I do have so much stuff. I guess it's because it's all in my inventory. None of it is in my fucking, uh... My bags. Which I should probably sort. Come on. Choppy chop. Choppy chop. Got a little more work to do. Choppy chop. Um... This goes in primary. This goes in secondary. Then we can shove a third log. A third log! Come on. What did I say? Do all the things that I said. Thank you so much. Oh, there's two logs in there already. What the fuck? You plotting on me, boy? I think this will be enough. I don't have uh, too much that I need to worry about now. Got the garden, got the collector barrels, got the fence, got a shit ton of guns. I guess I could stock up on like pharmaceuticals and shit like that, but it doesn't seem so important. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, I do need to chop all this shit up first. Doop doop doop. That's nice. 
And three planks sitting there. Yeah, I think I'm gonna run out of garbage bags before I run out of rain collector barrel shits. Which is awesome! Um, plank. Yeah, let's just, let's just build. Let's just build one. Another one. Another one. Oh, I don't have the shit. I need the nails. The nails! I need the nails! Duh. A, a big duh, Dayton. There we go. That'll do. Please don't break your little back. Mm-hmm. Nice. Do I have one more? Yeah, I can make one last rain collector barrel. That'll bring it up to five. Holy shit. Good job today, ladies and gentlemen. I'm quite proud of each and every one of you. Um, what am I missing? A garbage bag. Ah, that's right. Okay, fine. No worries. We can get garbage bags later. I'm gonna sweat it. I'm gonna sweat it. I must say that's a good day. That's a good day we had right there. I guess I'll get up to bed or something like that. Um, what else do we got? Could I eat this pike? I don't want to eat the whole thing. Ooh, slice fillet. Dang. Two fish fillets? Shit. Let's stretch that a little further, I guess. Wondrous well. So, friends, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy. And if you do, friends, I will send you a Skype call. <laughs> That's right, I'm giving out metaphysical objects now. I hope to f see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.